It's official. They're coming back on March 13th, 2017. Hello, hello, hello. This is Ashley and you guys are watching Ashley D Reactions and today I am here for another 1.5 kind of episode of Agase Adventures. It seemed that there were a bunch of you out there that kind of liked this video concept. So I will be continuing on with a series. I'm planning on announcing a new way of how I will be taking what kind of subjects that I will be covering very soon in the future. But right now I just wanted to make a quick, really quick video on pretty much the fact that GOT7 is officially coming back. They dropped their announcement teaser and Agassiz all over are already digging in deep and analyzing this teaser for any information that they possibly can. But I just wanted to let you guys know on my initial thoughts on the teaser and yeah. So first off, I just want to mention that the color scheme is really, really interesting on this. So obviously the color schemes, they always kind of match kind of mood and tone like with um with departure the colors were a bit lighter and the colors that they were wearing were lighter with turbulence the colors were darker more bold more intense and that was the kind of song we got it was more intense and it was also like really bold like hard carry goes hard um and also those were the kind of colors more intense Eye grabbing colors that we saw a lot associated with that era. But now we have Arrival and the first thing I notice is that we have this kind of like tannish kind of color and then we have like Agassé and it like fades into this Agassé green, um, God 7 green and it's just it's a really lovely color and the pairing is a really nice pairing but it makes me get the feeling that it's not going to be something as bold like as hard as hard carry and something that's a little bit smoother which i can totally get down with i'm really curious as to what we're going to be getting um so we have a list of all the things that are going to be coming out and I will run through them really quick in case you do not know. I'll put it on the screen over here. And so we've got the trailer that's coming out on 228. We ha so that is by the time this comes up, it'll be coming out in a few hours. Um, we're also going to be getting the track list. Take 24 is that we are getting marks. I don't know what this is. It could just be like photos. It could be like a teaser. It could be both. But whatever it is, it's marks. And then on the second, we're getting JBs. Then on the third, we're getting Jin Young's. On the fourth, we are getting the album user guide. So we'll finally get to know what exactly is coming in the album, which is wonderful and lovely because that makes ordering very easy. In case you were wondering, I am not running a group order for the regular album, but if they do an M wave, I will be running a group order for that. Keep posted for the information. I do have a sign up for that down below because my plan is that everybody who signs up the interest form will be entered in, t in for a chance to get um, a free copy. Um, you would still have to pay shipping, but the actual album would be free for you. And also everybody who joins will get an extra freebie. Um, and okay, so moving on, we have on March 6th, we have uh, Jackson's. Then on the seventh, we have Young Jays. On the fifth, wait, on the, on the eighth, sorry, I am not wearing proper seeing attire. Um, on the eighth, we're getting yu -Gi And then on the ninth, finally, we get Bam Bams. Then on the 10th, we get a group one. So yeah, everybody together, we have got sevens. Um, and then there's the 11th, we get the actual album spoiler. Um, the fact that the album spoiler is coming out so soon before the album comes out, I'm pretty sure it's going to be a mini. I'm pretty positive. Um, I mean, it could be a single, but I'm, I, I feel like it's going to probably be a mini. We're going to get, we'll know for sure by the time the track list comes out because that's when we'll know how many tracks are on it, um, which we'll know tomorrow. Um, and then on the 13th, we have the album dropping, the MV dropping, and it says that they're also having their first stage, which is listed after that. So I'm guessing that they may not, may or may not be having some sort of V Live. My guess is that it might actually be like 
they might do one of like the little showcase maybes and maybe that's what that is possibly but what's interesting is that at the very end it's like a little plane is like coming out like it's actually taking off maybe they finally arrived at the freaking airport <laughs> I'm kidding. I have no idea what any of this means. I know that there's breaks in there that are breaking up different sections and segments and I don't know what any of it means. I am not that kind of detective. Uh, I notice uh, certain things, little things here and there, like people have pointed out the fact that all of their shoes that are on the tops, um, if you zoom in real close, you can see that they all say got seven on the back of the shoes. People have pointed out something with the um, second A in arrival. I have no idea what that means. People have pointed out that in the GOT7, it's like a dart, like a, a, a target or a radar or something. Like it's got the circle things. I'll zoom into it so you can see it a little bit better. But I don't, I don't know what any of it means. I'm not good with like analyzing pictures. I'm generally a little bit better with videos, even though even with that, it's not that great. But I'm just really excited. I wanted to put out this short video. I will be... Um, doing react regular reactions for when they do the um, teaser and also for when they do the album spoiler um, so I don't know if I might do the little daily bits each day when they release the little tiny ones I don't know they'll probably just be short regular reaction videos and maybe I'll just combine compile them in the end into one of these Agassi adventures so that you guys can see them all together but yeah if you guys really do like these Agassi adventure videos please go ahead and let me down know down below in the comments and also let me know what kind of topics that you want to see from me next um, the next video coming up is going to be a some of my old reactions and my journey with GOT7 and then the one right after that will actually be my feelings on j Bomb. But after that I am open to suggestions on what I should do next so leave them down below. But yeah, I just wanted to make this video because I'm really really excited and I'm shook and I'm finally like composed enough that I can actually talk about this but I'm really excited. I hope that they kind of go like a little bit happy because I'm not ready to be shook with them going all sexy. I'm not ready for that. And it's not that time. When their next comeback, they can go all sexy. But right now, I'm not ready for that. But if you guys like this video, please make sure you like it. If you'd like to see more reactions from me, make sure that you subscribe. I'm out. <laughs>